Hi, my name's Russell James and you're watching The Raw Chef TV. In this episode, I'm going to make a beautiful berry dressing because uh, I had a, an email from someone who wanted to know how to make a, a berry salad dressing, how to use these beautiful berries we've got uh, to make a salad dressing. So um, it's so easy that I wanted to show you how to do it. Um, there's a number of different ways you can do it. Uh, I'm going to use a Vitamix to emulsify this, uh, this dressing. And emulsification basically is the action of um, mixing in permanently the oil with the water. So um, you know where you see a vinaigrette, so they're just put together in a, in a vessel and shaken usually, um, and then they separate and then you shake them before you put, your, put them on salad dressing. So that's not emulsified because it separates. Um, you can emulsify with the Vitamix, which is what I was going to do, or what I am going to do, and you might have um, maybe also seen emulsification happening in a bowl when a chef is using a whisk, and so that whisk breaks up the surface tension um, just like a Vitamix does. Obviously the Vitamix do, does it a little bit more vigorously um, with, with less effort to you. But it breaks up the surface tension of the oil and fuses the oil and the water components together um, and gives us this beautiful, smooth, non-separating salad dressing. Okay, so um, we're going to start off with these, with these beautiful uh, strawberries. Put a good amount of, of the strawberries in there. Just make sure I'm getting all the, the really nice ripe red ones. Um, then we are going to use uh, a little bit of rosemary. Okay, so rosemary with strawberries is a really, really nice combination. Um, if you're looking for combinations, you can just search online for, for good flavour combinations um, and see what comes up and you'll get answers like, you know, chocolate and strawberries and strawberries and um, rosemary. And that can be another thing. If you want to use a particular berry, if you want to use uh, blueberries maybe in your salad dressing, then search for what goes well with blueberries and you'll get all these answers that uh, might inspire you and maybe surprise you a little bit as well. So I'm going to blend those up. Um, I'm going to add a bit of salt to this as well. And then I'm using, uh, I'm going a bit posh, I'm using white balsamic vinegar for this. If you want to keep it purely raw, then you can use raw apple cider vinegar. Um, you could also use just a, a dark balsamic <coughs> vinegar, but I've got this white balsamic vinegar available to me. So I'm going to put a decent amount of that in to get us started, but I'm not going to put the oil in yet. I'm just going to get this blended down first. Okay, cool. So as I was blending that, you might have noticed I um, I started off on a low speed just so everything doesn't jump up the sides and then gradually turned it up as it starts to liquefy a little bit. So we've got this nice um, pink, pinky red liquid here and uh, we now want to add our uh, olive oil to that in a way that emulsifies it. So we're just going to get the Vitamix um, on its lowest setting, get it turning, so that's on number one. And then we want to add roughly about three times as much oil as we did the vinegar. And uh, imagine that's the whisk, and then you just pour in reasonably slowly your, uh, your olive oil. And of course, you know, if this is your first time doing this, you want to measure out your, your oil and vinegar. So that looks about right. And then at this point, if you, especially if you are doing it by sight, just have a, have a quick taste test. Oh yeah, that's amazing, that's really good. So, beautifully sweet. That uh, white balsamic vinegar is a little bit sweet as well. And we've got this amazing, and you can tell it's emulsified properly because of the, the thickness of it. The, um, the two liquids combined will be thicker than either of them are independently, if that makes sense. So the process of emulsifying them changes their structure. So yeah, it actually becomes a, a thicker liquid. And now you get this beautiful, beautiful bottle of uh, strawberry 
white balsamic salad dressing that I can use for the next week or so just to make any salad taste amazing. So give it a go, use different berries, search online for the flavour combinations and uh, let us know how you get on.